Das ist schon mal etwas. Cool. Clementine? Clem? Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's hm. this? He didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. He's a fossil. This is Vernon. He's a doctor. He helped me get back here after we got separated. I think you have something that belongs to me. Lee, thank God you're back. Krista, what's wrong? It's on me. He's gotten worse. Much worse. We have a man wounded. Who's this? Mrs. Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You have to help us. Please. I'll see what I can do. Take me to him. Hoffentlich geht's Umid besser. Umid, honey, you're gonna be all right. Lee brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. Da müssen wir jetzt auf jeden Fall auf Clementine schauen. Clementine? Müssen wir jetzt nach ihr suchen? Die kann doch hier nicht weg sein. Und überhaupt, wo ist Kenny? Hm. Da können wir schlecht in Badezimmertür. Na, schauen wir mal da rein. Ich, ich, die muss doch hier irgendwo sein, verdammt! So, Schlafzimmertür. Wo ist denn die kleine Hände? Hallo? Molly? Was machst du? Ah, du weißt, nur ein bisschen Du wirst nicht finden. Wir haben bereits den Ort gesucht. Du wirst dich überrascht, was Leute missen. Trust me, ich habe das schon für ein Weile gemacht. Wo ist Clementine? Nicht frag mich, ich bin nicht ihr Keeper. Hey, do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? Weil ich die zwei noch nicht getroffen habe. Ah, man, dann gehen wir mal zu Kenny und Ben suchen. Clem? Clementine? Ah, ich denke mal, die sind unten. Das ist einfach nur so cool. Come out, please. Kenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. First good thing that's happened since... Oh man. What the fuck were you thinking letting Kenny get like this? Hey man, I tried, but he gave me a look like he was gonna rip my face off. He won't listen to you. You think he was gonna listen to me? To hell with you! Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked! Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us, that crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? <lacht> ja, 
der ist fertig. Oh Gott. Oh Gott. She was frantic and things got kind of crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? Don't be sorry. Just tell me where the hell she is now. I think she went out to play in the backyard. Oh, oh no. god. With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. She better be or it's your ass. Oh man. Bleib mir echt die Spucke langsam weg. Clementine? Clementine! Na, schauen wir mal in den Schuppen. Okay. Na gut, für ein Argument. Zaun. Alter, es muss auch irgendwo sein. Alter, keine Klemmteile hier draußen. Das geht, geht mal gar nicht hier. Ah, nix hier, gar nichts. Das ist mehr als scheiße. Ziemlich scheiße, richtig scheiße. Ey Gott. Sag mal, was macht die Gruppe überhaupt noch hier? Gehe ich wieder rein, ey. Also hier wird die... Was? Okay, okay. Ich habe zwar jetzt ein dumpfes Gefühl, aber... Okay. Okay, okay. Oh Gott. Hey, Kleine. Naja, sie hat ja nur im Garten gespielt. Okay, was haben die denn gefunden? Wow! Ein Boot, ein Hoffnungsschimmer. Echt ein Hoffnungsschimmer. Omid's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound. He's got a real infection. Running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Well, you want the good news or the bad news? Ah, it's really good enough. Good news. Good news is the boat's seaworthy enough, in pretty good shape, mostly. Mostly. That's the bad news. Gas tank's empty, and her battery's dead. We need to fix both before she's taking us any place. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? 
Sounds like Crawford. the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try. If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man, might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. Ja, wir schleichen uns rein. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance? Yeah, actually. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's actually not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? Anyone else have a problem with this plan? Because we're gonna need every one of us to pull this off. Man, I don't know. I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. Ja, es wird gefährlich. Yeah, it's going to be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. Neither do I, Clem, but sometimes we have to take that kind of risk. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Where I'm going, it's just too dangerous. For children especially. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. Charmant. Can't I come with you? Ah, was soll ich machen, was soll ich machen? Hm. Okay, you can come, but you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm gonna go get ready. Na, ich habe ja früher irgendwie leicht gelernt, dass das irgendwie nichts Gutes bedeutet, wenn ich sie dauernd verhätschel. Was in dem Sinne eigentlich gut wäre. Aber, hm. Irgendwie sagt mir jetzt mal mein Gefühl, lieber mitnehmen. Nö. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? 
I took another look at the boat. She's a 30 footer. So? So we're going to have a capacity problem. Boat that size ain't going to hold more than five people, even with one of them a kid. Me, you, Sinner, Krista, Bonnie, Billy, Molly. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, that's still one too many. Even if we cut Molly loose. Before this is over, we're going to have to make a decision. You're not serious. Look, I'm just saying, if we want the best chance of... Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Help us how? I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're in and out faster. Anyone have a problem with that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Hold up just a sec. Are you ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind <laughs> of place Crawford is? If you take her in there and they find her... This little girl's not just excess baggage. She's gotten us out of a tight spot more than once. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. So, und dann gehen wir mal zu Crawford und mischen mal die Bude auf.